Today I have the pleasure of speaking with Dan Blondell of Nano One Materials. How are you today, Dan? I'm great, thanks. Uh, I really appreciate being here. Well, congratulations on your joint development agreement with San Goben. I, I, we're so excited for Nano One Materials. Can you tell us more about this deal, please? Yeah, so Saint Gobet is a, a large multinational corporation. They've got a 350-year history, and they have deep roots in materials and ceramics that are used in buildings, aerospace, energy. Nano One, as some of your your listeners will know, is a technology company. Uh, we're focused on the production of cathode materials for lithium-ion batteries. So what this deal is is about where our business interests sort of collide, and that's uh, we meet at the final stage of cathode production process. And that's where cathode powders undergo a high temperature process in a furnace. Uh, it's as simple as that. And so we're delighted to be collaborating with a company like St. Cobain. Obviously, they're very large and they have a very big presence. And it's a testament to Nano One, to our innovative technology, and of course, to our, to our people and the know-how that we bring to the table. Well, I, I couldn't agree with you more. So how would you describe the benefits for Nano One with this collaboration? Can you tell us a little bit more about that? So the agreement we have with St. Gobain is, uh, is to jointly develop technology that will enhance the, the thermal processing of cathode materials for lithium ion batteries. Um, ideally, uh, we, you know, we'll, we'll de develop this technology and have an offering, uh, a thermal processing offering for cathode manufacturers. And this will be uh, in the lithium ion battery market. And obviously it will be uh, with a multinational company with, uh, that brings a great deal of credibility to the table. Well, perhaps uh, you can talk a little bit more about how Nano One stands to benefit from this collaboration and joint development agreement. So we stand to benefit because um, a, we will be able to enhance our cathode materials. We're able to enhance our our thermal processing offering. So that's one stage of our of our process for making these materials. And obviously, we believe we can improve the performance. We can bring cost efficiencies to the table, and uh, and we bring a, a world class partner to the table as well as we uh, start to roll our technology out in a in a commercial way. You've had a lot of really substantial good news this last year, Dan. Yes. You yes. and your team at Nanowa Materials, and I noticed you also just put out an announcement for your tenth patent. So you tell us a little bit more about that. So, so that we have uh, that is our tenth patent. We now have patents in the U.S. and in Canada, in Japan, Korea, and um, and Taiwan as well. Uh, we also have thirty more patents that are currently being uh, uh, that are pending in jurisdictions all over the world, but primarily in the in the battery important uh, uh, jurisdictions. So that would be that would also include China. And, and Europe as well. Uh, we're very confident in our patent portfolio and its uh, ability to position us in the marketplace and protect the technology that we have, uh, we have moving forward. Of course, and looking back on your news for the year, Dan, is there anything else you'd like to draw our viewers' attention to? Well, 2019 is certainly going to be a very exciting year for us. Uh, the relationship we've been building with St. Gobain is only one of many. Uh, we are working with uh, large automotive manufacturers, with other, uh, other equipment manufacturers. We're working with battery suppliers and also with chemical companies. And each one of those relationships we've been nurturing with the, uh, with the point of bringing them into some kind of agreement or some kind of collaboration to uh, in, to improve uh, our offering, obviously, and in to uh, to bring a uh, to, to commercialize our product uh, into the mainstream. So you can expect to hear news about manufacturing, about joint develop more joint development of technology with some of the the bigger bigger or biggest names in the uh, in the lithium ion battery world uh, as it stands today. So we're very excited about uh, about the people we're working with, and we uh, hope to bring that news to everybody and your listeners included in 2019. Well, as the countdown to 2019 starts, I'm just going to tell you, Dan, we're going to have you in our top 10 stocks to watch for 2019. Thank you for joining us today. Thank you. It's a pleasure being here.